everyone, welcome to Tech Games. So today's video, we're going to be looking at the temperatures of the brand new i7 8086K. Got it right here in this system, got a NZXT Kraken X61 cooler attached to it, everything's just stock. Haven't changed the fan curves or anything, I'm just letting it go with its stock configuration. At stock setting, the CPU never went over 50 degrees Celsius, no matter what program I was using, I tried Ada 64, Cinebench, Firestrike Ultra CPU test, Grand Theft Auto 5, and Far Cry 5. The first ever clock I tried was I just set the multiplier to uh, 50, didn't change any of the voltages, but made it so it could do 5 gigahertz on all cores. The max temperature recorded with all cores at 5 gigahertz was 80 degrees Celsius. And finally, now, disclaimer, I'm not the best at overclocking. I know. I need to work on it. But I was able to dial in a 5.2 gigahertz overclock with 1.35 volts. I can probably bring that down a little bit. I don't think that's the final number. Maybe that'll help me get the temperatures a little lower. But at 5.2 gigahertz, the highest recorded temperature was 90 degrees Celsius. And generally, anything I did, it was sitting at 75 degrees, between 75 and 90 degrees Celsius. In Far Cry 5, the highest temperature recorded was 82. But in Cinebench or any kind of synthetic test, it's right around 88, 90 degrees. Now, this video is going to be short and sweet. I just had a couple hours to play with it. I have more time this week. Maybe I can dial in a little bit better overclock. And the, the catch is this chip is not mine. It is a friend of mine. Uh, I bought the motherboard. He bought the chip. I'm going to eventually get an 8700K probably in the next like two weeks or so. Uh, but the chip is his. We haven't decided if we're going to delit it or not. He's not necessarily big on voiding warranties, which is completely understandable. So we may have a delitted video for this chip later this week. We will see. Maybe I can get a little higher overclock. I don't know. Well, that just about wraps it up for this one. If you have anything you want to see done with this chip, just leave a comment down below. I uh, should be able to get to it this week. Not sure. We'll see. I have to see how many requests or anything else that we get. But leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know if there's anything else you want to see, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.